Here's a recap of all of the items updated in Momentum this week. So the first two are in the endorsements area. So we go on the left-hand navigation menu down to miscellaneous and then endorsements. And we added Momentum pages for agents, commissions, and commission adjustments. So similar improvements to every other Momentum page comes with this improved search, improved customization with being able to edit the columns and add new columns um, and the overall speed, you know, it's a lot faster. So agents, commissions, and commission adjustments. The next two items are within an insured. So if we go into Amongst Cafe here, we added new insert slash edit pages for drivers and group health members. So let's go here. There's the edit screen. It's now in the momentum edit page. And then the insert, so add new. It's just a lot faster. We're going to be able to do a lot more with it. So there's drivers and then group health members. Moving past that, improvements to our general ledger, which we continue to add more and more to until we have a full general ledger. So that's very exciting. But we have the journal entries area. So let's go down to miscellaneous and then it's under accounting items and it's journal entries right here. So this is where you can add in brand new journal entries for your ledger account. And then we've also added improvements to the insert process. So whenever you go to insert brand new ones, it's just way cleaner. So we added this page, this main list, and then we added a new insert page. So it just adds the item right there. You could add multiple. It's great. Go ahead and play around with it. Um, we should have a full general ledger very soon here. And then the last item on here is under interactive reports, the insurance and prospect by reports, we added a zip code filter. So if we go to insurance by, there's the zip code filter. And now we do continue to make improvements with fusion. Um, some of the things we added this week, we added new touch points. So we added opportunity stage change. Last week, we added the ability to create an opportunity so it can, you know, enter your pipeline. Now you could actually make it so it changes stages mid workflow. So that's very exciting. And then also notification, which just pushes an email to any party involved. So it can go out to the agent, the CSR, you know, any other email. And we're going to have some improvements to this next week. Also next week, we're going to have the ability to enter categories for tasks. So it can create like the 20 stages over now certs that you have preset up. And then also if you see due date, it will be an interval instead. So it won't be an exact date like we're seeing here. It'll say like one week, two weeks. So you could just say, you know, whenever that task is created, it's due a month later. If you're interested in testing, go ahead and email me at kaden at nowswitch.com, K-A-Y-D-E-N at nowswitch.com.